First of all, Nikki, uh, talk a little bit about this uh, past weekend. Uh, you guys went down to Orlando and uh, saw some great competition and ended up winning a championship. Uh, what kind of weekend was it for you? Um, we uh, played really well as a team. Uh, it was all an awesome tournament, beautiful weather. Uh, we got to see a lot of good pitching down there. Most of all, we really figured out what kind of team we are. Um, we, uh, we hit very well. Well, play great defense, and that's what it's going to take to win ball games. Now, in the championship game, you played a, a team that I think had a couple of uh, D1 signees, maybe going to Miami and Florida International. Is that the best team that you've seen since you've been here? Uh, most likely, they could really play. Uh, they had a center fielder that could swing it, played good defense, uh, sort of took away some hits from us. But uh, the catcher, um, you know, great receiving guy, had a good arm. Their pitcher, you know, lefty could locate, had a good fastball, good off speed, and. Uh, you know, it was it was really really good uh, test for our team, and uh, it was a really good tournament. Helps to have Philip Pfeiffer on the mound, doesn't it? Oh yeah, he <laughs> he's uh, every time he's on the mound, you know, there's a good chance of winning. Uh, he's going to throw strikes, keep your defense alive, and he, he's he makes me happy when he's on the mound. For yeah, us. instead of throwing at you, huh? Oh yeah, definitely. I love being on the other side, <laughs> yeah, watching sure I got everyone. Now this uh, this tournament uh, down there, how many teams and from what all parts of the country did they come from? I think there was about 15 teams. Uh, farthest away probably was the Virgin Islands, wow. which was uh, pretty neat to play them. But uh, there was uh, most teams were from Florida area. We were probably second or third team farthest away. So, um, but uh, it got us good to see uh, play in warm weather and play a bunch of, te bunch of teams from Miami and see their kind of talent and the way they play and just learn from them. Now you got the MVP award, which I know has to make you pretty happy. Yes, sir. Um, uh, I felt, you know, it was probably one of the best weekends I've played, best week. Um, I hit well, played good defense, um, ran the base pass well, and uh, yeah, it turned out to be really good for me. Are you guys uh, coming back home now and uh, getting back into the, your, uh, your league play and everything? Uh, you got to feel like this team, uh, after the showing this weekend, has a pretty good chance to maybe get back to spring fling and uh, try to put another banner up. Oh yeah, I'm definitely. You know, our team right now is getting momentum. Uh, we had about three days off, so we really need to come back today and uh, play strong and keep that momentum going. And uh, hopefully, we'll just keep getting better and better to, uh, when it comes in uh, May, so we can win another state tournament. We got a new coach this year after uh, Coach Farr was here all that time. Uh, Matt Buckner comes back from Bearden, of all places. Uh, how's it been with uh, with Matt? Uh, he's turned out to be a really good fit for us. Uh, he's an awesome guy. Um, you know, he helps you when you're struggling. Uh, he's always going to be there. He's uh, You know, he helps you to be good on the field and off the field. Uh, very classy guy, and uh, he's turned out to be a great fit for us. Now, you also had some news a couple weeks ago that you're going to be playing college ball with your brother. That's got to be exciting news. Yeah, we uh, uh, he committed about two weeks, a week before I did. And, uh, you know, I really couldn't, you know, go anywhere else. You know, it's been a dream of ours to play together in college and win a national championship ever since we were little. So uh, uh, it will take a lot for me to pass that up, and I'm really excited about it. It's going to be kind of different uh, wearing the Georgia red. You wore orange for a long time when your dad was coach at UT. Oh, oh I know. It's uh, it's going to be different, but uh, when I come back to play at Tennessee, it's going to it'll be pretty special for me. I bet it will. Congratulations on uh, being the Calhoun's High School Athlete of the Week, and best of luck this year. Thank you.